I'm going to the beach. It's my birthday. I had a headache. I just, oh my god. I don't know. It's not just like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I had to work anyways because, you know, I had to make money. But I I, I understand. Like, nadie le gusta, nadie le gusta trabajar. Like, but it como que. It's hard to work for somebody else. Like it's better to be your own boss, having your own business. Like that's what I want to do. Like in the future, I want to be my own boss and run my own thing that I don't have to depend on anyone. Oh, but I have to start from the bottom, and this is my first, like my first job. So, and I want to get out of there already. <laughs> But I'm gonna do it for a couple months and see what happens after those couple months. But I don't know. I don't know. So like after almost two weeks um, at work, like this is just a temporary job. It's gonna be done next week. And next week we know if I'm gonna like stay there, you know, like officially. So how I feel about it, like, <laughs> no me gusta, no me gusta nada, no me gusta nada. And I don't know if I don't like the place or I completely, completely, completely don't like my career because. Sí, a mí no me gusta mucho mi carrera. No sé si es porque here in my country, like, my career is not, like, well, how can I say it? Like, it's not appreciated, like, that much. And we should be um, more appreciated because, like, we do kind of, like, a, a lot of work and it's important. So, uh, that's kind of, like, get appreciated. And what the... <laughs> <laughs> so last week I got like a little frustrated I had like two days that they were pretty bad like um, the two one of no yeah. I was having like really good week and it was already Thursday and I had to draw blood from uh, a little kid and when it comes with kids, like I get a little emotional because I know that they're scared, they start crying, and sometimes I don't want to draw blood for them because I cannot see like a kid crying. Like it really, I just I can't. And I he, this kid was like a little shabby, so I called my coworker, like, hey, can you please help me with this kid? I don't want to draw blood from him and not not get any blood and have to do it again so she came so after that um, like a, maybe two patients later I had to draw blood for another person and this girl has like the veins really thin like really thin and sometimes when they're really thin they're really hard to get to so I did it and I couldn't get the blood so I called my co-worker again and said hey can you please help me and I hate asking for help because I don't want to look stupid or yeah I don't want to look dumb because I know what I'm doing just I don't want to look dumb so this old lady that she was so freaking respectful I was so ready to yell out here 
And I know you have to respell, <laughs> you have to respect your elderly, but alguna gente como que, o sea, porque piensan que ellos son mayores, como que ellos te pueden hablar como a, te, a ellos de la cana y no, no, no. So she would say, oh my gosh, she doesn't know what she's doing, she's too young, blah, blah, blah. She doesn't know how to do that. What is the other person? There is somebody here that is older and know what she's doing and this and that. So I was hearing all that and I was starting feeling like shit. So I went to look who was talking and I saw her and she saw me. And I stared like her like, so you're gonna keep talking? And I, when I turned around, she was, I don't care if she's um, listening or seeing me what I'm saying, blah, blah, blah. She doesn't know what she's doing. And I felt so bad because that's the last thing I wanna hear from someone because first of all, I know what the fuck I'm doing because I went to school and I went to college and I have an associated degree that says that I know what the fuck that I'm doing so don't say that I don't know what the fuck that I'm doing and it doesn't matter that I look beyond because it doesn't make any sense like eso no me importa a mi de que yo me vea joven que toque el otro yo si se lo que yo estoy haciendo but people don't know that drowning blow is so fucking hard it's not that easy as people think and it's so freaking stressful so that person telling that I don't know what to do and that uh, this and that that was like the last drop for me and that day I, I didn't drop any blood because I was so mad I didn't want to like be around anybody so the other day as soon as I get to the job they tell me oh you have to go and drop blood to the emergency um, so I go and this girl she have like really good like a really good vein there and I got there but I couldn't get the blood so I tried to get and I couldn't and I felt so bad because I already had like a bad day yes the, the other day and now we're gonna have a bad day today again I was like damn so I feel so bad and I felt stupid again and I just like um, I went to the bathroom and cried because I felt so frustrated that I couldn't do my job like I felt so bad with myself like cuando yo me frustro Yo tengo que llorar, yo tengo que llorar. I, if I get frustrated, like I have to cry. And I went to the bathroom and cry. And after that, I had to draw blood from another person. I couldn't do it. I was feeling, I started feeling dizzy. I started feeling so bad because I was still like, I started to feel pressure because, like, you, when you're working, like, you want to. Um, give a good impression with your co-worker and I don't want to my co-worker think that oh my gosh she's so stupid she cannot down blood blood but she like she was so sweet she was like don't get mad about it it's, it's okay like when I used to do that I used to do that too I like, had to drown blood like I couldn't do it properly and blah 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 but I kind of like feel bad anyways and I don't know how to feel about it like Today was a good day and Saturday was a good day too. So I think you just have bad days, but I, I, I just am not sure if I really like like my job. Like I don't like it. I don't want to stay there. Um, but let's see what happens later. Like because I really believe in God, and if if, if God really wants me there, there is where I'm gonna be. So. Let's see what happens. I don't even know if I should say that I don't want to be there because if they see this video and they say, oh my gosh, she doesn't want to be there, they don't hire me. But I don't know if it's a bad thing or a good thing. And I don't know if they watch my videos. Like, who watch my videos anyways? Yeah, that's that. But, uh, that's how I feel. So, let's see what happens after I am done with the with a temporary position that I have right now in a 7 minute video